Styling hair can be a risky business. Yeah, really I mean, cuts, curls, colors, and hard to please customers are small stuff compared to the risk that one Peru stylist took. Yeah, in fact, she courageously turned what some would consider a setback really into an advantage, giving customers something they have never, ever experienced. Here's our Rich Van White with the story. Rebecca Riker grew up wanting to be a hairstylist because she didn't like them. Most of them, yes. <laughs> Bad, isn't it? <laughs> they weren't bad stylists. They just couldn't understand what Rebecca wanted. Not everybody can get what they want if it's not communicated right. Give them what they want, what they ask for. Rebecca is hearing impaired, and sometimes communicating can be difficult. She also speaks sign language, a skill most stylists don't have. Honestly, when I get a haircut, there's not a lot for me and the barber to talk about. But for many women, every curl and cut is a big deal, something to talk about. The owner of the Peru salon saw an opportunity. She said, we should do a video, and I'm thinking in my head, are you nuts? And I want to reach out and let anyone know who needs a sounding good interpreter hairstylist. Even Terry Turnpaw admitted it was risky. I was afraid some people would get scared off. People who are not impaired, thinking that she cannot hear them. And it turned That's, out. It turned out the opposite. To everyone's surprise, business almost doubled. Rebecca is booked up. Many of her customers are also hearing impaired. I did not realize that it would mean that much. Many of her hearing impaired customers travel from other communities. Sierra Finnerty is grateful she has a stylist she can talk to and trust. I told her, don't have to price me. Don't be frustrated. I love her. She did wonderful. Rebecca never imagined there was such a need for her skills. So much response. That was all good. I did not get anything. That was like, wow, what is this about? You know, I got nothing but love and support. For a hairstylist who is a cut above, Rich Van White, Channel 13, Eyewitness News. And we have nothing but love for her as well. Now, customers are driving from as far away as Kokomo, even Logansport, to get to the company salon. And they, of course, have Rebecca style their hair. Yeah, That's Rebecca's become very popular. Really I love has. that.